just on 40 minutes of shape, 40 seconds of shape rather. He's looking at 10 minutes for 15 shape. Can they keep it up? Will they get any faster? You very often see at that hand seat. I'm sure it gets quicker as it gets a little bit warmed up. But turn to that last peak again. Beyond King, a couple of blues ahead of Johnny Kirkpatrick. Just coming up on three minutes. And four sheep out the floor home. Exactly in three minutes, for This is a brilliant time for the young man to the whole play. Three minutes and already sheep number five's on the board. Settle her down beyond. He's got a little hummer. She's a humdinger and look at him. He just works his way around the belly. We talked about it the other day. There's no wood on his legs. She's got legs like Paris Hilton. Up the neck he goes and he works the way. With beautiful curvy legs as he works his way onto the first shoulder. Long, low time. Three minutes and 26 seconds in. Dion King. He's now starting to put a bit of space between him and his other boys. This is the man that's shown 866. Well, now it's time to get up there, Dion, and down he goes. He's actually piling it on Screamer. He certainly is there, Coral, right there with him over that shoulder. Now we go with Johnny K. Dean Ball comes over that shoulder on the last line as well. Long blow time there, Paul Avery. And long blow for Jamie. But it's all Dion King at the moment. He wants it and he's working it like a machine, Alan. Yeah, and he's got it four minutes exactly gone now. She's six in the top knots off. He's kept that pressure up. He's kept the pace up. You're right there, Scream. Around the back of the head he goes. Dropping into that third front shoulder. Dean Ball is putting a bit of pressure on Johnny Kirkpatrick, but it's still Johnny K. Second, but very much. Dion King from Napier turned to the last five. He's got it between the teeth, and I don't think he's going to slow up one little bit there, Screamer. Yes, you're certainly right. Another quick one there by Dion King. He's charging down there. Paul Avery's having a bit of a struggle playing with him. So is Johnny. On to that last shot. We go with Dean Ball. Yeah. Up the neck and around the back of the ear. We go with Jamie Fagan. But Dion's just dealing to the ground. Yeah, he's turning a right four minutes more. He's sheep seven out on the board. That's a very, very quick time. So eight more sheep left in that catching pen. And he's knocking a heck of a hole in it. I think you're going to be just outside that 10 minutes, but it's still a very, very good time for these 15 competition sheets. Just over 40 seconds of sheets, and that she's there now. Bill Dwyer is coming out the porthole, Gary. Well, Dean Ball has actually come back into the picture. Dean Ball is up there, right there with Johnny K. We know this man has got the quality on his side, and he turns to the first shoulder. Onto the long blow, Dean Ball. He's now picked up Johnny K. Big, strong sheep is this big mighty boy going to handle it. Down the last side is Dean Ball, and he's a humming. Down the last side he comes. In goes Dion King, sheep number eight. What have we talked about? The kryptonite is starting to kick in for the king. Into the undermine he goes. One, two, up the neck he goes. Round behind the ear and this king is getting faster. He's now starting to stroll it out. He's the man that likes that rap shit screamer. He loves that sort of music. Well, let's play some rap music. Long go time for King Screamer. He certainly is hungry. Over the top we go now. Step up the neck right there with him. Dean Ball, Johnny Kirkpatrick, and Paul Avery. Up there just up along the same level as our uh, man, the king. He's just motoring away at the moment, but it's still early now. Not even halfway through, Alan. Oh, yeah, about halfway all right. There's only 15 seconds. He's going to put on the second floor. He's going to put on the second floor. So that's over halfway into that first back leg he goes, and I think it's going to be Dean Ball Coru, the man from Peabody. He's pulled up and gone past the Johnny Kirkpatrick there on stand three. Did you see Dean Ball go in the pen? He didn't walk in, he skipped in like a young buck. And he went there and he pulled it out and he says, Hey, Dion King, here I come. He bounces up the neck there just like David Fagan. He's picked it up and onto the first shoulder. Long good time coming. He's now starting to put a bit of space between him. Johnny Kirkpatrick, Dion King coming down and he's in for sheep number 10. Five sheep and it's only six minutes and 50, ladies and gentlemen. Sheep number 10 on the board and he's got a little beauty. It's the one that you dream about into the undermine one two king hands up paul avery coming back into the picture quite quietly he's now picked up johnny k here comes paul avery screamer yes he said he has stuck back into the picture but it's still me on into the long blow on the top notch we go with dean ball he's certainly working well he's coming back slowly and every blow he has he's picked up a wee bit more jamie Baker just going in for number nine now He's moving along well, but it's still on, punching down that money run. On to the last button. 
We got the OC for Long Blood for Johnny, Long Blood for Paul. That's all happening here in Dorothy. Yeah, change of steel for the man, Pink of Napier, he's got a new handpiece on, he's got a honey of a sheep. Down the middle he goes, change of steel for Dean Hall, just about caught him up there, Corey, look at that, he's only into that first back leg for Dion, on the way down the belly for Dean Hall from Tikawiti. I've never seen ball shear so fast, well this man is on fire, one, two, and like we said, he must be going out pig hunting tomorrow to Kate. Catch that big ball with the big tusk because he's working on it now. On to the first shoulder, but here comes King coming down the last side. Pick Patrick up the neck, Paul Avery up the neck, James Fagan, he's not too far behind. I think that's sheep number 11 for all these boys, or James Fagan, one behind. No, so they're all on 11, but Dion King, and he goes down the last side. Screamer comes Dean Ball. Yes, he's certainly working well at the moment there, Paul. Look at him fill up that comb. He's trying to knock that last right out. It's good to pull. Well, it's happening. Now in for number 12. Up the neck we go with Dion King. Punching out on the money run. Who's Paul Avery and Johnny Kay? Long blow time there for James Fagan. The belly goes flying. Dean Ball sends it in behind. And that's in the undermines now. Where's Dion charging over that last shoulder there, Alan? Yeah, over the shoulder he goes, and he's still well in front. Dean Ball will be the next man in there, up the neck and round the back of the end for Dean Ball. And Paul Avery not too far behind him. Johnny Kirkpatrick not used to having that much of a gap over 12 sheep. Sheep 13 on the board, just two left of the pen there for this man from Nathan Freeman. He's having fun on the entire sheep. He certainly is there, Alan. He's certainly making it work. He's got a half a sheep on the uh, next one, so he's certainly making it happen. Here we go with Dean Ball charging down that last side as well. Really taking that comb to the sheep. Johnny Kay's right there with him. Paul Avery sneaking up like you said there, Paul. Don't discount the baby-faced assassin. He works his way into the belly. Has he picked up uh, Dean Ball? Well, he's right there, Dean Ball. Here comes Paul Avery. He's right behind you. The veins are sticking out in his head now. He's winding her up and around behind. Peter and Wendy Buchanan, sheep are real pearlers. These are what dreams are made of, ladies and gentlemen. They're just flyers. Long no time for Ball. He turns to the last side, getting ahead of Paul Avery. I thought they'd turn the same time. Alan Smith. Yeah, we'll just about 10 minutes gone. Top off the deep ball. We've got to keep an eye on these fellas. Look at the baby face that's happened for Avery. He must have done a top two third. Eyes that way up, check 14 it is for stand 22. Dean Ball and Paul Avery in together. Johnny K just there with him. And into that long blow and almost just two for the last side. Look at this man King, he's put a sheep around the young baby face of the world. Sorry, Jimmy Fagan down there at the far end. And he's only seen him quite that far behind us. There it is, the whole sheep. And he's only got one left in this attempt there, Screamer. This is it. Sheep 15, it is so heavy. Yes, that's all Dion the, the King at the moment, ladies and gentlemen. He's certainly taken it to the party, and he's rocked on in there. What's that little race going down there between John and uh, Paul Avery, the baby post assassin? He's uh, taking a wee bit of a little lead on um, Dean, so that's got to be good there, Alan. Yeah, just a bit of a regular there for Dean Ball, so these two. You see Paul Avery get away to a slow start. What's he doing? A rough one. What's he just warming up? He's got that injury. He's just getting over. Bit like taking nothing away from Dion King. A leg of that for a minute strong. And he's just on the last side for it. Down the last side comes Dion King, ladies and gentlemen. 11 minutes and about 25 seconds. This is one of the fastest times we've seen here in a long time. There's no one there that's up to upset, but down. Look at Paul Avery coming back at him. Give him a good hand, ladies and gentlemen. He on pace. About 7.35. Paul Avery splits him up. Give him a hand, ladies and gentlemen. Here comes Dean Ball. Give him a hand.
this is a good chance for you to go and grab a couple more cans if you want to, and uh, if you need to go to the little ladies room, well, this is the chance you'll have. The only time I sit still for camera is when it's uh, in front of a cop. <laughs> turn left, turn right.